playing with toys, playing with each other, or just hanging out people watching. Cats are known for their curious nature, but Ripley's found one feline whose unusual habits set it a breed apart. Because believe it or not, this cat insists on living in a tree. And it hasn't come down once in over three years. You hear me? Come on down here. The strange scenario all started when barking dogs sent his cat clawing up the bark of this oak tree. Charles McLean, a resident of Carthage, Mississippi, named him Tree Cat after discovering the frightened feline clinging to the branches above. I heard a little kitten hollering up in the tree, so we came out and investigated it. I tried to get it down, and it was frightened, and it went up high. Come on out of that pocket up there, and let's go eat. Tree Cat, who's got plenty of altitude to go with his attitude, has Charles wrapped around his furry little paw. In fact, Charles gets up every day at 6.30 just to make breakfast for his feline friend. Then, climbs a 15-foot ladder to leave the food on a platform he built from scratch. Charles even designed a little dream house to shelter Tree Cat. He got a good view. He can watch the traffic. He knows he's going to get his meals on time. Now, some of these other cats around, they don't know when they're going to get their food. Not even wicked weather is enough to drive Tree Cat down from the 60-foot oak. Still, Ripley's conducted a stakeout to be absolutely positive he wasn't sneaking out at night. To everyone's surprise, Tree Cat never budged. In fact, he even has a guest now, a little black kitten who recently climbed the ladder and made himself at home. So Charles built him a house, too. A couple of months ago, I noticed another black, jet black kitten up the tree with him. And they're getting along. Feline expert Dr. Tracy McFarland believes Tree Cat must have experienced a significant trauma to drive him up a tree. She still can't believe it. 17 years, I have never heard of a cat going up a tree and staying there. And although a skittish tree cat won't let Charles hold him, he has become friendlier over the years, even allowing himself to be petted at times. So is tree cat destined to live out his nine lives in that big oak tree? I guess when I get too old to climb the ladder to feed him, someone else will probably climb it and feed him. He's got it too good up there. He's got it better than any cats I know of.